विंग मेकर्स चेम्बर फॉर फिलोसफी इमोशन सोल एक्विशन टेक्निक सोल एक्वायर्स इमोशनल रिस्पॉन्स थ्रू द ह्यूमन इंस्ट्रूमेंट इमोशंस बाई डेफिनेशन आर रिस्पॉन्स टू ए टाइम बेस्ड इवेंट एन एनर्जी अ मेमरी और एन एक्सपेक्टेशन द माइंड एंड बॉडी predominantly condition emotional responses while the soul observes and acquires their constructive essence of bonding appreciation and special insight the body and mind also acquire learning from the emotional responses but unlike the soul they are unable to sift the constructive from the destructive so they are more affected by the emotional responses of anger greed and fear these emotions anchor the mind to the survival based energy system as firmly as anything in the world of creation the spirit essence of the human instrument that guides it to wholeness with source intelligence and ultimately first source is emotionally personified in the form of a voice this voice is heard in the abstraction of poetry that is designed in a specific rhythm and vibration of meaning the technique of emotion soul acquisition is concerned with discerning the emotional voice of a poem intending that voice to resonate within your soul and releasing the emotion that arises from the resonance letting it wander away from you like a wild animal released into its natural habitat there are 10 poems within the wing makers ancient arrow site that are designed for the application of this technique they are circle forever one day listening afterwards of this place warm presence another mind open of luminous things and song of whales each poem strikes an emotional chord of subtle discord it is discordance that stirs the emotional responses making them accessible to the higher energies of the human instrument this discordance is not concerning anger greed or fear but rather the more subtle feelings of separation abandonment and spiritual neglect the emotion soul acquisition pays tribute to these feelings and seeks to position the tether of discordance in the hands of soul thus ensuring that the emotions have voice and influence in the shaping of soul's judgment insight and reasoning it is the quiet emotions of separation and abandonment that fuel the strident emotions of fear greed and anger poetry can bring forth these quiet emotions and liberate their presence to the soul and in so doing allow them to be honored and in this process understood this understanding helps to diminish the anger and fear of the mind and body which disaffect the human instrument from source intelligence and realization of the wholeness navigator consciousness thus the emotion soul acquisition technique is to trace the voice of the 10 poems to the subtle emotions of abandonment and separation allowing these emotions to arise within one's self as if they were on display to your soul these emotions are like ropes that pull the strident emotions 
into your life stream which anchor you to the energy system of survival. To the extent you can eliminate or diminish the ropes of the quiet emotions, you can eliminate or diminish the strident emotions.